my name is Kylie Titano. I am a graduate of UCSD's Computer Science and Engineering Department 2014 and I graduated with a degree in Computer Science. Uh, right now I'm working as a Software Engineer in Test at Intuit. So Software Engineer and Test, um, a, lot, a big misconception about Software Engineer and Test is that it's just testing and writing scripts to test software. Uh, that's actually not the case. Um, software Engineer and Test is, it's a pretty new concept and the idea of it is to solve prop software engineering problems in the testing space. So you get to use your software engineering skills that you've learned here at UCSD or at your internships um, to innovate in the test space. Uh, what I do is I work on a desktop product. It's called Pro Series. It's a big clunky software, 20 years old. Um, it's made for accountants who prepare taxes. So as a software engineer in tests, what I'm trying to innovate on is how our testing process is done. Currently, it takes three people six months to manually test our product. Currently to solve for that problem, I am working with an open source framework to write UI tests that can accommodate the whole product. So originally uh, when I was looking into majors, I knew that I wanted to be a game designer. Um, so I, I applied for computer science because I knew that the job would involve programming. Uh, but along the way, as soon as I got to learn more about computer science and I took all of the classes here at UCSD, I found that computer science can apply to anything. So I kept my mind open along the journey and now I'm a software engineer in test, which is something that I didn't think that I would get into as a freshman. Yeah, I, I remember the exact moment. It was with CC12, I believe the beginning data structures class. Um, it was, I was working on a really tough assignment. I entered the lab when the light was, when there was still light out, and I exited when there was still light out. I stayed there overnight. Um, and it, it was a pretty tough assignment, but I, I emerged feeling, you know what, if I can solve that really hard assignment, I know I can do anything in this major. My favorite class was CSC 110, Software Engineering. Um, I'm the type of person who likes to see things all come together at once. And in that class, um, there were different roles. There was project manager, there was test lead, there was architecture lead. Um, so it was really great getting to experience the different types of roles that you could play in software engineering. That, and it was the class that closely mirrored what I do today in industry. So I found it really useful um, just to give me a taste of what I, it was just a taste of what I could do. One of the many possibilities that you could take was computer science, the computer science major. Struggling, yes, I think that's something everybody goes through as a computer science major. Um, there were definitely a lot of classes that I took during my time here that I didn't find useful, maybe they'll be useful someday. Um, but what got me through them was knowing that I was learning how to solve problems in different spaces. Um, that's so useful today, especially now being a software engineer in test. I had no idea that this was a possible route for me. But what my struggles taught me was to learn how to be innovative and creative in different spaces of computer science to solve problems. One thing that I wish I had known earlier is to not rush through any of my classes. Um, I was trying to graduate early and I feel like I passed some really great classes that I, was, I, would, be, I would have been interested in, but because I was trying to graduate early, I passed them by. Um, so that is one thing that I wish I had known. One advice that I would give uh, newcomers to this major is to don't compare yourself to others. Um, people learn different types of material at different paces. You might excel in one class and learn that really quickly, but in another class you might find yourself struggling. It's okay, just take a breath and know that you're gonna get through it. 